One of the more easily recognized cell structures in any cell is the cilia or flagella. Now, when you look at them, it's very easy to get them kind of confused when you're first studying, but the basics difference is pretty easy to spot because essentially with cilia, you'll have lots of them, but individually they're small compared to the flagella where you'll have many, sorry, you'll have long ones, but not too many of them. If we take a quick look over here, here's an actual picture of two cells. And you can see there's lots of these short little projections that are sticking out of the cell. Whereas here, with this cell, it has a few flagella, but those flagella are much longer than the individual ones that are called cilia. Now, in general, their function is the same. Both of them are used for moving the cell or moving things around the cell. Now, with flagella, with the prokaryotes, there's a weirdness about them in that their uh, flagella rotate, whereas ours undulate. If we take a look at this picture, here we see an E. coli bacteria, and you can see the rotating uh, shapes here of the flagella. They basically operate kind of like an outboard motor. Whereas our flagella, instead of operating like that, ours undulate to create what's called a sinusoidal motion. Now, you may be wondering, how is that possible? How is that achieved? Well, if we take a look at the basic structure of any cilia or flagella, you'll see that they are essentially this column of microtubules that are covered in membrane. And if you look at the shaft of the flagella, you'll see you have these pairs of microtubules. There's a set of nine of them. In the center, you'll have uh, two individual microtubules. This is sometimes uh, referred to as the nine plus two arrangement. Down at the bottom, you'll again have your nine set, but instead of having pairs, you'll have groups of three microtubules. So that's called nine again, but because there's no microtubules in the center, this is called the nine plus zero arrangement. And the basic way this works is that each pair of microtubules takes a turn going up a little bit. And so you'll get this up, 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 up rotating. And if you've ever seen those weird little wobbly uh, guys who are set up, to advertise and attract attention at a car dealership. That's kind of what a flagella would look like if you could see it at the cellular scale. Cilia don't flop around nearly as much because they're so much shorter, but they'll still tend to do that wave-like motion. And that's how cilia and flagella work.